Hello everyone, please welcome and join me in Chef's Cooking. Today, I'm going to share with you a very delicious chicken recipe. I'm going to make chicken in pressure cooker. The way I'm going to make it, it will be super tasty and super delicious and very healthy. I have a whole chicken. Take the skin off, cut the chicken into small pieces, trim the fat, wash it with the cold water. One cup peas, cauliflower, half cup of florid. One carrot, onion two color, yellow and one red color. Potato, one tomato, one garlic bulb, eight to 10 garlic cloves, two green chili, about two inch ginger. Spices from a salad above. And for our turka, I'm going to use olive oil and we're going to use water as we need it for our curry. I'm going to clean up the chicken and I'm going to cut into small pieces. I took out the skin and I washed it. Now I'm going to cut the chicken into smaller pieces. We're going to keep it big chunks of for all the things. We are not going to dice it. And I'm going to share with you how to make it tasty and delicious curry. The whole chicken is cut into smaller pieces. It's a good idea to make a cut on a drumstick. So that is perfect. The cauliflower, I cut into this big pieces. These are two florets. This is what we did with the onion, cut into four pieces. Same thing with the tomato, carrots cut in big chunks, ginger, the same thing, cut into big pieces. And the potato. Now I'm going to bring the pressure cooker. Four cup water, salt, one tablespoon, cumin powder, one tablespoon, grinder powder, one tablespoon, turmeric powder, one tablespoon, Black pepper, half tablespoon. Curry powder, half tablespoon. Deggi mirt, half tablespoon. One tablespoon, garam masala. Mix all the spices, this is good. Bring cauliflower. Prior to cutting all the vegetables, we washed it. We'll bring sweet peas. Mix it again. I'm going to bring two more cup water. Initially, we added four cup, so I'll bring two more cup. So all together, six cup. Now I'm going to bring the chicken. You have to keep watching this video until the end to see how tasty and delicious chicken going to be. All the vegetables at the bottom and the chicken at the top. I'm going to cover the pressure cooker. We're going to put it on a gas. After two whistles, I'm going to turn off the gas. I'll start gas and we're going to keep gas on the high. We're going to wait for two whistles, then I will turn off the gas. We have our second whistle and I'm going to turn off the gas and we're going to let it rest. The pressure cooker has been cooled down and we're going to open it. Wow, look at this. This is looking very delicious. All the vegetables at the bottom, the chicken on the top. We're going to take the chicken out in a separate bowl. Try to drain as much as possible. Look at the leg piece, perfect. The chicken is fully cooked. So I'm going to take out the, all the chicken pieces out of the pressure cooker. I taken out all the chicken pieces into separate bowl. So this is how our curry looks. Now this is what I wanted to share with you. I'm going to use hand blender. Once it's cooled down, you can put it in a food processor or if you have a hand blender like this, I'm going to blend it all the vegetable. And it's all done. So this is all our gravy. The curry. I'm going to bring kasuri methi. I'm going to rub between my hands. It will be two teaspoons. Looking good. Mix it. This is looking really nice. I'm going to put this one on a back burner and we're going to start the gas. I'm going to let it cook. The curry is fully cooked. Since we added kasuri methi, I want it to have that kasuri methi flavor to go inside our curry. With our turka, cinnamon stick, cloves, maize, bay leaves, red chili, and one tablespoon cumin seed. So I'm going to start gas, the front burner. I'm going to get a pot to bring olive oil. You can use any oil, two tablespoon olive oil. 
will bring the cumin, bay leaves, cloves, maize, cinnamon, red chili, and we're going to cook these spices for one minute. Cooking for one minute, now I'm going to bring the chicken. This is the chicken we pulled out from pressure cooker. Start the pan, and now we're going to cook the chicken with our masala. Our chicken is fully cooked, so we're going to cook on high gas for two minutes. Cooking for two minutes, this is looking really nice. I'm going to bring the gas to medium, and now I'm going to bring the curry. We're going to turn off the gas. I'll pour the curry. So we're going to keep adding the curry. Look at how delicious, creamy curry. We haven't added any cream or any butter. I'm going to bring all the curry. Perfect. It's all done. Now the last ingredient, cilantro. Fresh dhania, the coriander leaves. Good amount of coriander leaves. A new style of chicken curry is all ready. This is super delicious. Just mix it. I'm going to turn up the gas. I'm going to dish out and I'm going to share with you. Our very tasty and delicious chicken recipe is a new way of cooking. It's very delicious. Please try it and you always can serve with the roti, chapati, naan, polka, pranta and best of all with the rice flour. If you like it, please share and comment below and I'm going to see you soon with the new recipe best of all easy steps cooking thank you and have a good day bye bye